Morning Wolf Pack. I'm Isabel Herman. And I'm Noah C. Today is Friday, March 4th, and we're here with your morning announcements. The CUHS Red Cross Club is having a fundraiser next week. It'll take place on Thursday, March 10th at the Fish and Things Poke Bar on Laguna Boulevard. Are you interested in being a part of the COHS cheer team next year? Cheer clinics will take place from March 30th to April 7th. Anyone interested in trying out is welcome. Scan the QR code in the top left corner to register for the clinics. The Serve to Change Lives speech contest applications are due today. The contest will take place next Thursday, March 10th. Check your Synergy emails for more information. Is there a teacher on campus that you want to recognize for demonstrating our IMCO principles? If so, stop by the leadership room and fill out an IMCO teacher edition slip. That teacher will then be entered into a drawing for the next staff meeting. Juniors and seniors, ball and prom tickets are on sale for the rest of the month. The dance is on Saturday, April 9th from 7 to 11 p.m. here at CO. Tickets cost $45 and formal attire is required. There will be food available for, to purchase. Don't like to dance? Don't worry. There will also be a game room and a movie room. Speaking of prom, Culinary is hosting a fundraiser dinner to help raise money for junior prom. Tickets can be purchased at the student store or with the school site controller. With the purchase of a dinner, you will also get a prom ticket. There will only be 100 spaces available for the dinner, so get your tickets fast. Email Mrs. Henderson for more information. Now let's check out the Community Club. Um, hi, I'm Kristen. Hi, I'm Caitlin. And we're the co-presidents of Community Club. So we usually meet at the Food Lab, which is located at the Culinary Building, um, and we meet every other Friday. So typically during meetings, we're doing some sort of volunteering activity. Um, today we're doing a campus cleanup in which we're picking up litter on campus. But in the past, we've also done card making, and recently we just made boxes for a food drive. Um, Community Club is a really good opportunity for students to volunteer on campus, and especially since a lot of students can't really go out and volunteer outside of school, then it's a good chance to earn a service hour, and it's also a really good chance for students to socially interact and hang out with friends while doing something good on campus. If you are interested in being a part of the community club, follow these instructions to join the Remind. As term three comes to an end, library materials will be showing up as due. For your textbooks and note novels, hang on to them until your teachers tell you to return them as a class next week. For scientific calculators, those do not need to be renewed and are checked out for the rest of the year. Non-scientific calculators do need to be turned in or renewed for AP textbooks hang on to them until after your AP exam. After your AP exam is done, you can return them to the library at any time the library is open. It's the end of the week, and you know what that means. It's time to pass it on over to Dylan and Paula for POP. What's poppin' Wolfpack? I'm Dylan Brazier. And I'm Paula Sabulo. And this is POP, where we pop in and show you posts of the pack. Now let's take a look at our fantastic Friday posts. Up first, here's Kalia looking pretty and happy birthday. Next up, here's Isaiah Davis in Disneyland. I hope you had fun in the happiest place on earth. Finally, here's Charlotte, who's also in Disneyland. Dang, now I want to go. Man, me too, Paula. Now here's our Wolves of the Week, Bella Robinson and Haven Figueroa. Hi guys, I'm Haven Figueroa. And I'm Bella Robinson. And we're your Wolves of the Week. We're both on the softball team and we're both the team captains. Yeah. Uh, my favorite memory from CO is probably the, show, the hype showcases. Um, but definitely freshman year was my favorite one. My freshman year we made playoffs in the for, for the first time in a really long time um, for softball, so that was pretty cool. Yeah. Well, both of us have the same teacher. Uh, it's Miss Raisin. She's an econ teacher. Um, we call her our school mom because she's always there for us. Yeah. As far as favorite class goes, probably AP site. That was pretty interesting. Um, <laughs> I'm going to Mississippi Valley State um, on a softball scholarship. So uh, I plan on moving to like the Bay Area, hopefully Santa Barbara, do community college for the first two years, and then transfer in. I'm not sure yet. I have a joke. Okay, go. <laughs> <laughs> do you want to hear a joke about some cats? Yes. Just kidding. <laughs> I would say take everything that people say to you in high school with a grain of salt um, and also get your license and get a job as soon as you can because it made my experience way better. Yep. 
We started off the season with a win against Christian yes. Brothers. So, yeah. We're undefeated. <laughs> come to our games next week. There'll be a home game. And yes. Yeah. And uh, come support us. It's going to be great. Thanks, Bill and Haven. Good luck with the rest of the year. If you want to be featured on next Friday's show, make sure to use our hashtag CHSWPTV. Well, Wolf Pack, thanks for popping in with us. Back to the anchors. Thanks, guys. Well, that's all we have for you today, Wolf Pack. I'm Isabel Herman. And I'm Noah Seed. And remember, the strength of the pack is the wolf. And the strength of the wolf is the pack. Happy, Happy National, National Grammar, Grammar Day, Wolf Pack. Wolf Pack.